Hey guys, welcome back. I have a really great video for you guys today, especially you ultralight people and kind of do-it-yourself people. Uh, we were out over the weekend. Uh, we had to stop at a few stores in the mall, and I went to, did I just say mall? Wow, the New York is still in me. I went into uh, Bed Bath & Beyond. My dogs are helping, so if they get noisy, just yell at them. And I found this. This is a Blue Ridge Active Packable Down Throw. Uh, travel Sports Outdoor Home Cabin. Ultra lightweight, filled with premium quality down, 650 fill power, ultra warm, stuff sack included. And they have it as oversized, 60 inches by 70 inches. So about five foot by six foot. Not the greatest color selections. This is kind of like a, what do they call it? Cinnamon stick. They had red and they had blue. But what I liked about this, number one, was the price. Uh, $19.99. So $20 for a down blanket. They call it a throw. But I was thinking more or less like for the for us that do like the DIY, uh, an underquilt for a hammock. Get a sewing machine, you take your measurements, make an underquilt. Certainly throw it in your sleeping bag. Uh, you could do a, a ton of things with this. Now, the 650 fill power, what I understand about that is they start at like 200 and go up to like 900. So I'm guessing 650 is kind of in the middle. And how they rate it is the smaller the number is the smaller the feather. So like a 650, let's use an example, um, is kind of a smaller feather. So when they pack it with the big feathers, that gets you up to like your 900, uh, what do they call it, fill power where it gets big and it gets fluffy and it's warm and it's cozy. But 650 isn't bad. I mean, comparing it to like say a, a 300 is like comparing a washcloth to a beach towel, if you can understand that. But let's, and it is, it's light. I mean, the heaviest part of the, the package and the whole thing was, oops, sorry Ori, was the cardboard. There's your stuff sack. I mean, and it's, it's good size. I mean, I can put it on me and, you know, wrap right up with it. And I still have plenty left to, oh, and it's soft and warm. But you could easily, easily, see how big? Easily make an underquilt out of this if you know what you're doing. I don't sew a fabric, that is. I mean, I can sew on a sewing machine, but... But I wanted to share it with you guys. I mean, if you have a, a Bed Bath & Beyond by you guys, check it out. I mean, it's huge. I'm going to be trying it out next week. I'm going to do a couple nights camping out. And uh, I'm definitely going to give her a try. I mean, this is it folded. There's the stuff sack. Let me, uh, let me bring you down here a little bit. See if I can get back far enough. That's Chetty, Teddy with his chew toy. And it's very light. Very light. So, I wanted to share it with you because I know you ultralight guys always are looking for something that's, you know, doable. How do they have this stuff sack on here? I guess you don't take the stuff sack off. You just stuff it in there. These will be coming off. But hey, for 20 bucks and it's down, I mean, who can complain? Of course, if you get it wet, it pretty much loses all of its uh, fluff and warmth, but it's all a part of camping, right? Let me stuff this in here. Hang on just a second. I gotta put it down to stuff it. 
I'd say it'd be about the size of a double hammock. And there you have it, right about the size of a double nest hammock. So let me know your thoughts on it. I mean, 20 bucks. It's down. It's packable. It's warm. Let me know. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you on the next one.